What comes to mind when you hear the name Fred Mukasambide, East African community legislator, good orator, and using fancy, bombastic English for something that could have been communicated simply? My fellow combatants, <laughs> the antagonists, and the Kasanguinite, and that was the way. <laughs> Phrases like I cannot koto in your puhu, and like the country has been rendered despondent, war begun on a foreign gram, are the quitters of our brother Mose, are some of those that have made him quite popular, but have also caused people to look through their dictionaries for the meaning of these words. When I went to Makere University, I was told for you to become a guild president, you must be deadly. There must be a language in which you must address. I can tell you, I was elected the guild president of Makere University for speaking for 20 minutes without anyone understanding what I said. <laughs> Born in 1974 at Nachenyi village in the current Rengo district in Greater Masaka sub-region in central Uganda, Mukasambide was raised by his parents, Emmanuel Mbide and Mary Kinto, who were teachers. His education at Kiziba Primary School in Rengo, Kawoko High School, Masurita Boarding and Kampala High School paint a different picture of the man many consider to be a thitherous of sorts. There is heaven very close to earth. When one, you realize what you are, you speak frankly. Maintain the truth. This is something that in the politics is extremely absent. In law, I have been telling my colleagues, we call it veracity. The truthfulness of a person, veracity, verity, or dinkum oil. Now, <laughs> that is what we call it. In 1999, Mbide joined Makere University for a bachelor's degree in mass communication. He served as a guild president and later joined the school of law at the same university. Yes. I would address them in all manner of language. When you go to Kabanjolo, they tell these are agriculturalists. So you address them, Dactalias, Karala, They tell you these ones are medical students. You say, okay, Makere University is now fossilized. It, it has a gout and varicose vein. It is never <laughs> According to Mbide, joining the Uganda Young Democrats, a wing of the Democratic Party, while at Makerere University, partly shaped his political journey. He is currently the vice president of the party, having engaged and failed in the battle to represent Kalungu East in the parliament. Be they opted to challenge the NRM party on the way the elections to represent Uganda, the East African Legislative Assembly, were being conducted. In 2012, Mbide was chosen to represent Uganda on a DP ticket but he took off the party jacket to become a champion of regional integration. When I was coming to the assembly for the first time, I thought I, it was a furtherance of my political activism. I, I have spent 10 years without mentioning the two letters of my political party, DP. I have not seen where I would mention it from. I, I, I have not seen it. And uh, I can tell you it has been a learning experience. Uh, however, it is also a challenge. To the extent that those that think that you have been, you have, they sent you as a champion of activism, they might turn around and begin to think that probably you have become the result of a compromise. He recently scooped an award from Karibu, East Africa, for being the best regional legislator. Bide also gave an advice to the youth who were attending a summit in Arusha. So, yes, there is no, we call it consensus and the idem. There is no meeting of minds. But we are still handling. When I see you, the young people, I, I, I get so happy. It is reminiscent. I, I personally also remember what I have been. Then I know. When you look at me, you know what you will be and even beyond. Ten years after his time in the house, Bide has left an indelible mark. You can imagine me writing a book for eight years uh, on, on integration. It is titled The East African Community. A sine qua non of integration. Now that is going to be a masterpiece. And now I am heading to the country. It is safer that I was out of the country. I completely koto to integration. Thank you very much. Jingo Francis, NTV, Arusha, Tanzania.